this is every. No, I don't. I don't mean every, but there's quite a few stars that are. I mean, I mean planets that are weird. Yeah. Why did you discover Mayram? A myriad of planets over there. Like, just look at all this craziness. We're not going to talk about you, unfortunately. You're the weirdest planets. Ta-da! Finally, we're back. I know my hands are kind of wet. I'm not trust to be. Okay, I'm gonna have to write real quick. Here I am again. Next up is Kepler 70B, aka. KOI 55B. Here. Yeah, isn't it just a relatively strange planet? <laughs> well, everybody, let's get to learning about Koi 55B or KOI 55B. And I just took it, sorry. Here's artist concept. Nice, right? It was discovered in 2011. And it's terrestrial. Kepler 70b, aka KOI 55, could well be another circle of hell with an average temperature hotter than the sun's surface. Yep, the sun's surface. It used to be a Jupiter size. It used to be Jupiter size until it spent some time inside its now dead star. A trip that destroys most planets, but left this one a Freddy Cougar like burnt world smaller than Earth. At about 12,000 degrees Fahrenheit, 600 800 degrees Celsius. Hey, that's more than the burning heat of heat shields in space flight simulator. That's only approximately 6,000. So I think this is 800 above. It is one of the hottest planets discovered. In fact, the planet itself is evaporating, soon to be another victim. KRA 55b is a terrestrial exoplanet that orbits a B-type star. Its mass is 0 0.44. It takes 0 0.2 days to complete one orbit of its star, 
and is 0.006 astronomical units away from the star. Its discovery was announced in 2011. Here's KLI 55 comp be compared to Earth, and here's KLI 55 compared to our Sun. Yikes! How could that be? Fifty five koi is supposed to be really big because it's a B type store. But it's really not even half the size. Yep. I think that planet is very weird. Hello. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Uh, are you afraid of the dark? What interests to be is not an area for you. It's a gas giant composed mainly of gas. It was discovered in 2006. Oh, and it's gas tank. Are you afraid of the dark? Welcome to Trestubia, the planet of eternal night. Dark the darkest planet ever discovered orbiting a star. This alien world is less reflective than coal. Inside this atmosphere, you would be flying blind in the dark. Some scientists think. An eerie deep red glow would emanate from its burning atmosphere. The air of this planet is as hot as lava. Trust to be is a gas exoplanet that orbits a G type star. Its mass is 1.49 Jupiters and takes 2.5 days to complete one orbit of its star. And is 0 0.0356 astronomical units away from its star. Its discovery was announced in 2006. It was observed by Tress. Of course. Seems like they gotta trust to be transit. <clears throat> now, let's go to another one. Kepler 7B. I wonder what makes it so strange. Okay. It was discovered in 2009. It's planetype gas giant. On July. For 2016, 
Philo's spacecraft entered Jupiter's orbit to study the king of our solar system. But Jupiter is tiny compared to some of the exotic exo-Jupiters found in our galaxy. Yep, that's Independence Day 2016 for the USA. My home! Likely to number in the billions, more than 3,000 light years away, floats Kepler 7b, a gas ranked 60% larger than Jupiter, but half Jupiter's mass. That means Kepler 70b has roughly the same density as styrofoam. If you found a bathtub big enough, Kepler 70b I and mean 7b could float. This monster is also more than 12 times harder than Jupiter. They sink it among the exoplanets known as hot Jupiters. It orbits a Jupiter so closely in a, a scorch of five days. That it is tidy locked like Earth's moon. One side roast by day, the other is more permanently shrouded in darkness. Kepler 7b, he was also the first exoplanet to have its clouds mapped, produced using data from NASA's Kepler and Spitzer telescopes. Its cloud map revealed weather patterns that can conduct superheating air from the roasting frack of the planet to warm side in endless freezing night. NASA's Juno mission could also teach us more about hot Jupiters and the giants in our galaxy. But seems like overall it was discovered by Drumro please. Da -da -da -da! <gasps> Kepler. I think that's why I got to me. No, bye. I know we meant to do very many cats, but I had to read all about them. So, bye.